Hi, uh, today I'd like to show you exactly how I put uh, the medication into the right spot on the heel when I do inject the heel uh, condition. And uh, this is what I struggled for many years uh, to find out exactly where to put the medicine and it's very important. And even myself, when I, when I did it without this machine that I have, I was wrong about 50% of the time of the exact location where to give the injection. So I'm gonna show you how I put uh, uh, this machine put on the foot so I can put it exactly where I want the injection to. This is a plantar fasciitis or uh, people call it heel spur syndrome. Uh, Dennis, uh, my patient here, doesn't have a heel spur, but he has a plantar fasciitis with lots of pain where it attaches into the bottom of the heel bone. So I'm gonna go right to that area and then I'll give it injection using this machine so we can locate exactly where to go. Okay, so now I'm uh, injecting the heel. I know basically where uh, I need to inject is around this area. I already numbed the foot here, so this whole area is numb. So my patient Dennis won't feel it, right? Yes. You feel any of this, Dennis? It's pretty yeah. numb? Okay. It's really numb, doctor. Okay. Yeah. So, so Dennis is a nurse at a hospital. He's a uh, he's very hard working guy. You, where, where do you work now? I do work in the emergency room, doctor, mm -hmm. where mostly I keep uh, my feet uh, off the ground and uh, roaming around, walking mm -hmm. every now and then. Mm -hmm. So I kind of located uh, with the machine exactly where that spot is and then I started injecting. Exactly where I'm injecting, right at the bottom of that heel bone right there where I need to be injecting uh, with this live x-ray machine so I can exactly locate where I need to inject, which is really important because uh, if I put it in the wrong area, it uh, won't be uh, very effective. So uh, it's a pretty quick process once it's numb. So I, the area is numbed, I'm, I go in deeper and then I inject right at the insertion site of the tendon into the bottom of the heel bone. So I'm injecting. How do you feel, Dennis? Any pain at all? I don't feel anything. Okay, though. okay, good. So uh, this is another thing that I do uh, is different is that I numb this area really well so that the patient doesn't feel any pain uh, when the needle's in and out of that area because I want to kind of inject kind of all around the area of the insertion of the tendon into the heel bone. So this is how I do it. After the injection, I put tape on this so that uh, it immobilize the foot so that the medication that I put in here doesn't go all over the place uh, for about 24 hours. And then they can take the, the tape off and then they can go back into their orthotics and their activities at that time. So this uh, injection is done uh, every uh, two weeks. Uh, and then obviously I tell them to take it easy after the injection for about two days because we want a medication to stay there in that, uh, in that area to work. So I make sure they stay off and take it easy, uh, not standing and walking, do a lot of things that uh, they shouldn't be doing. So. This is how I do my injection, uh, a little bit more exact uh, to the point uh, of, of where the uh, pain is, and then uh, it's a lot more effective when I do it this way.